Hey everybody, Father Tony here. It occurs to me that now that we have uh, just passed 2,000 subscribers on our YouTube channel, that many of you probably don't know the origins of the Gnostic Wisdom Network channel and podcasts and all that stuff and, and why we do what we do. So I wanted to take the opportunity in this vlog to kind of tell you that story. You can find my personal story about how I came to be a Gnostic in uh, another video on this channel. If I remember, I'll leave a link in the description. But I've never really talked about why I do this as, uh, you know, why I've chosen to do this as part of my, my ministry as a priest. And uh, so here's, here's that story. It all started about 2011. I was running a nonprofit called Gnostic NYC with Bishop Thomas Langley of uh, what was then the Alexandria Gnostic Church. And uh, because I didn't live in New York City, I lived just north, uh, about an hour and a half, an hour, hour and a half north of New York City, uh, I was traveling down for uh, meetings on the weekends. And we would stay up late talking about Gnostic stuff, because I would stay at his place. And, uh, you know, we, we had all of these interesting conversations, and I thought, you know, this is just kind of being wasted on us. You know, it's interesting for us to talk about this stuff, but wouldn't other people be interested to see and hear the kinds of things that we were talking about? Kind of figured that if if we were so interested in this stuff, then there must be other people out there who are as well. And, you know, we have the ability to uh, provide a resource for those people. So that's what we decided to do. And that's why we started the YouTube channel and started Talk Gnosis, which was really just a reflection of those conversations that we were having anyway. We were fortunate enough to be able to bring in many guests and interesting people that we wanted to talk to as a kind of a side effect of doing the video show. We got to convince smart and interesting people that uh, you know they should talk to us and share some of their knowledge with us and with you by extension. Now, since the incident with Bishop Langley, we have gone through a lot of changes here. You know, we've brought on a whole lot more people to help out. Uh, we've got uh, producers and we have additional video content and even more stuff planned for the future. Uh, we would really love to be expanding our programs and, um, and we are doing that, we're expanding our programs. Um, just a little sneak preview, of course none of this is set in stone, but we are working on some things. We are working on a new show with Scott Jones and Jason Memel uh, that has to do with kind of Lovecraftian stuff and weird religion and science fiction and comic books and pop culture and how all that stuff uh, ties into spirituality. It's going to be a really interesting new show for us. Greg Kaminsky is coming back with The Lost Word, which we did a couple of episodes of, and I have a few kind of in the can that I haven't edited yet. Um, so I think we'll release those few that I have stacked up, and then we're going to get into recording new ones, and that's going to be more geared specifically towards esoteric Freemasonry. So that's kind of an interesting thing as well. We're also tossing around several other ideas that aren't fully fleshed out yet. Um, some kind of a, a show that's more, that's less kind of less educational, less intellectual, and more kind of emotional, spiritual, um, you know, w what I'm thinking, like, uh, like almost a homily format. We don't really know what that's going to look like yet. But anyway, all that stuff is very interesting. And so <clears throat> that's kind of what's, uh, what's happening in a nutshell. A few months ago, I quit my secular job in order to do this stuff full time. Uh, I'm fortunate that I have uh, the opportunity to do that and, and I don't have very many uh, expenses so that I can do this um, essentially for free. Um, I do make a little bit of money off of the Patreon stuff, uh, but you know, it's not, it's not like I'm raking it in by any means. What I would like to be doing, however, and how you can help us to spread the light of Gnosis uh, which is what we try and do here at the network, is I'd like to be able to start paying everybody else that also works on the network and does an awful lot of hard work. Um, I mean, I do this stuff all day long now, but a lot of other people kind of spend several hours a week preparing for shows and, and getting things ready, and they do it on their own time, and they volunteer, and, you know, I am just so grateful to everybody who has done so. Uh, but I'd really like to be able to expand beyond what we're already doing. And in order to do that, I really need your help. So in celebrating our 2,000 subscribers on our YouTube channel, and coming up next month, it'll be four years on the channel. 
I would really like you to consider becoming a patron on our Patreon page, our Patreon campaign. Um, if you do, and if you just pledge a little bit of money, and you can set a monthly cap so you, never, so you never go over, we're going to be able to start generating even more content. I'd love to get to the point where we're releasing one or two videos every day for you. I think there's enough content and enough interest out there that we can start doing that. Um, but we're just not quite there yet, and, uh, and I don't have the resources to make that happen. So please visit our Patreon page if you haven't already, even if just you just want to take a look. It's patreon.com slash gnostic. That's p-a-t-r-e-o-n dot com slash gnostic. And, you know, take a look and see if maybe that's something you'd be willing to contribute to. Uh, it's very easy to do. You just put in your information, and at the end of the month, uh, your card will get charged, and you can, like I say, you can set a cap. So you never go over, and so every time we produce a piece of content, you, you pledge a little bit of money. It's really very simple, and I really like the way that they do that. So um, I hope that you would consider doing that, and if you have any questions, you know, please give me an email or put a comment in the video description or whatever. Uh, I'd love to hear from you. So thank you, everybody. I really appreciate all of the support that you've given to me and to the network over these past four years. And here's to many more years and to many more thousands of, of subscribers. That's a hard thing to say, thousands of subscribers uh, over the, in the coming years. And, uh, you know, if, if there's anything that we can do for you, uh, any content that you might be looking for, any, anything that we're not covering yet that you think that we should be, let us know. You know, we're, we're not here to just talk to ourselves. We really want to make you a part of what we're doing here as well. So uh, thank you once again, and I am signing off.